Hey Aquarius, I'm back y'all with another reading. So this is going to be a read for the month of January. So if you have Aquarius in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, south node, you can utilize this video. Alright, so let's talk. Give me a message for Aquarius, please. So we got the Ace of Cups here at the bottom of the deck and the Four of Swords. So some of you may be feeling like a little tired, may feel like you need to take a break. Yeah, I see a lot of running around, a lot of back and forth going on. Yeah. Lots of <laughs> lots of back and forth going on. A lot of juggling going on, honey. All right. So, I feel like some of you guys could be juggling. I'm hearing a fire sign male. I'm seeing a fire sign male. Or a Pisces or a Cancer or a Taurus. I also see that you could be spying on this on this person. Or someone a fire sign could be spying on you. I feel like you're getting tired of talking. Okay. You are very popular. You're very um, sought after. You get a lot of attention. It's something here. You're spying on you're spying on somebody. The magician. Yeah. It's a um I'm getting a mail. Someone could be asking you for money, asking to borrow money. It looks like you're very uh focused on yourself. Some of you could be juggling because you are single. For my couple ones, I feel like you could just be watching, looking watching um a partner, keeping an eye on a partner. I do see that you are being very, um, like you're you're depending on yourself. Like you're not being codependent at this moment. I see you actually focusing on yourself. Like you're focusing on your bag. You're focusing on your money. But it's something or someone that you're keeping an eye on. And the challenge is that this person is very flighty. Like this person is very here one minute and go on the next minute. This could be leaving you feeling stuck at times. Yeah, this person is a is sneaky. Mm -hmm. This person is sneaky. Could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person is very sneaky. So you're just keeping an eye on it. This person could, could actually have stole some money from you before. So this is why you're keeping an eye on this. I see you um, having an issue with that five of wands. I see you having an issue. There could be uh, someone. I feel like someone could have possibly stole something from you. Oh, that jumped. Okay. When they could have just asked. When they could have just asked. That's how you feel. Like you could have just asked me. Okay, you didn't have to you didn't have to take it from me. We got the lovers here, it could be a Gemini, but I feel like this is someone that you that you love. You thought this person loved you, but I feel like you're starting to see otherwise. Could be a Leo. But I feel like this is coming to an end. You're putting a stop to this energy right now. Like you're you're tired of you're tired of it. This is something that has been ongoing. Okay, this this it hasn't been the first time. This hasn't been the first time. It's not the first time. Yep. 
I see you being real disappointed with this person because you just thought that you and this person was better than that. You thought that y'all was better than that. You thought that y'all was better than that. This person is manipulative, okay? This person be playing mind games and playing tricks, okay, with that magician. You didn't think that this person would ever do nothing like this to you. But the thing about it is, is this person may have some type of addictions. This person may have some type of codependency issue. They could be real greedy. The relationship could just be at a toxic state. You tried to give this person a chance, maybe because you was close to this person. For some of you, this is a friend. For some of you, this isn't for in regards to in a relationship. But for some, this could be someone that you thought was close to you. Could have been a friend. And you decided to give this person a chance. You decided to give this person a chance. And then you realize that this is not going to work. It's not going to work. They they just waited in the cut for their moment to betray you, to stab you in the back. And I feel like you love this person. You love this person. You got a strong love for this person. But you told them they got to go. Told them they got to go. Yep. You told them if they don't get out, then you're going to kick their ass out. You're going to have to use force. Um, and you know that this person could have been struggling. And, and you could have been doing very well, like I said. But you just feel like, just leave. Just just go, okay? Before it get, before I have to, before it get ugly, okay? For some of you, this could even, like, involve, like, gunplay. The police getting involved. Yeah, I feel like for a lot of you, you was really close to this person. Not, and like I said, for some, this person was supposed to be, you thought this person was your real friend. You thought this person was would never do nothing like that to you. For some of you, like I said, this is a friend from your past, but they always show signs of being, um, just the energy ain't, ain't right. The energy ain't right. The energy is not right. I feel like this person reaches out to you. This person reaches out to you in the near future. But you're. I feel like you already feel how you feel. You already feel like you already have all the information that you need. I feel like for a lot of you, it is a female. For some, it's a female. For some, it's a male. But you're starting to realize that you can't help everybody. You're tired of wasting time on the situation. You got your own things that you're trying to do. You can't waste no more time on this situation. You can't. You can't waste no more time on this situation. Yep. You feel like you don't wasted enough time. It's like two... It's... The damage is done. We got the Ten of Wands. The damage is done. So you got to make a boss move. You got to make a... This person could be Aries. You're going to have to go ahead and make the decision. I feel like a lot of people... People tried to warn you about this person. Um, but I feel like you gave this person a chance. I feel like you gave this person a chance already. This person may look at you like, they may feel like you're being too controlling and everything has to go your way. This person could be trying to make it seem like you have too many rules. And we keep getting that six of wands and a magician. And see, this is you. Everything that you touch, everything that... You put your energy into is successful. You could have a fire sign that's watching it, that sees that. They could be jealous. They actually is is like your competition with that five of wands here. Okay, so it looks like an argument was started. <clears throat> I feel like an argument is started because something comes up missing. Something could come up missing. This person is, like, coming in and out of the home. 
um, Person real, real flighty, real sneaky, very. Maybe feel like this person is taking advantage. You need to, you just told this person like I love you. Told you I'll see you later, but it ain't go how it, it is. Like mm, mm, this person is giving me real sneaky vibes. person don't want to work they don't want to put the work in they don't want to put any they don't want to bring nothing to the table and you done gave this person so many tries to get it right but you just feel like it's not fair it's not fair to you it's not fair you gonna put a stop to this now The Emperor is the father card as well. So this could be like a, a father, uncle, someone in the family. Um, this person could be older than you or you older than them. Person don't they got they got a chip on their shoulder because they feel like um something that you said or did wasn't right. They know a lot of your business. This person knows a lot of your business. They've been feeling like they've been keeping quiet, but um they know a lot of your business. The devil keeps showing up here. It could be a Capricorn. Ooh. Okay. It's about something about who you could be having sex with. Okay. It could be about who you're having sex with. They know that you don't want that to get out. Maybe this person is trying to blackmail you. Queen of Wands, High Priestess. Could be a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or a Pisces. Ooh, so this person could be trying to blackmail you. Ooh. Okay. Children could be involved. I'm hearing children could be involved. Ooh, we got the moon and the empress. Yeah, I, I'm seeing somebody new the whole time. Okay, 
So it's like, why you wait till now? You knew the whole time. The moon and the empress is giving me real side piece energy. Or somebody that is supposed to be kept a secret. Or this person has a secret. Yeah, it's something you regret falling for this. You fell for something. And you like, I ain't falling for that no more. The I meant the King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. Let's get some clarifier. There's certain things that I want to get some energy on. I definitely want to get some energy on this moon and this empress. I want to know more about this King of Pentacles as well. This moon and this empress and this king of pentacles. Tell me about the moon. I told you somebody's stalking. Somebody is stalking you and they are a snake. I'm telling you, somebody's watching you. You got an enemy. You got an enemy. They're coming towards you. They're coming towards you. And they are about to take some type of risk. Or they're being strategic. We got hand of cards. They are coming towards you with some type of proposition. They're coming towards you with some type of proposition. Um, they are definitely watching but they come in as the snake. This is competition, enemy, clever, malicious. The other woman looking over your shoulder. Who is this empress? Seduction. So this empress is coming in being seductive. Okay. We got the runner and then we got palm tree. This is like someone's home, someone's home life. And someone could have cameras up. Ooh, then we got love and then we got stabbed in the back. Somebody's running somebody household when they're not there. Okay, tell me more about this seduction. I'm getting two different stories. Yeah, somebody told you you got to watch out because you got a snake. Sunglasses, the snake, and girl talk. Somebody telling you that you need to separate your business, your personal business. You need to separate. Because you got somebody watching, you got an enemy. Who is this King of Pentacles? Cupid's Arrow. 
the butterfly and bolt. Okay, so whoever this King of Pentacles is, it could be Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person is very self-indulgent. They only focus on themselves. They could be borderline narcissist or full-blown narcissist. They're coming towards, they're either coming towards you with, they're, I'm getting like somebody's coming Twin flames and a chaser. Yeah, somebody's chasing after a man. Somebody's chasing after a, a man, okay? So I'm getting like there could be really much so side piece energy coming on here. Somebody's chasing after somebody's man. They say, hey, ain't no ring. Ain't no ring on his finger. Hmm. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Be sure to hit the thumbs up. Share with your family and your friends. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.